Students at Tennessee State University are learning that college can include some fun and games. Yeah, the school is using video gaming in the curriculum as a pathway to recruit minorities, especially black females, into STEAM academic programs. News Channel 5's Kelsey Gibbs spoke to a few students who say they can make a real career playing video games. Ever since a kid, I was always interested in games because I watched my, my dad and my brother play it. Tennessee State University freshman Kiara Davis is talking about video gaming. I've always been interested in like gaming and stuff. I have a Twitch and everything. What type of gamer are they? So are they like a hardcore gamer? Not only can students take courses on video gaming, but the one who's actually by her, the one who's coaching her up, she wants to see her succeed and wants to help her do better. The campus also has an esports team where students compete on a collegiate level. I kept on searching up whether we have an esports team and stuff. And when they finally sent out that email, I was like, this is for me. I'm going to join. So you see the arrow like, on the squares? There you go. TSU is using esports to promote pathways into STEAM programs like computer science, healthcare, and education. The fact that people can actually make a good living off of video games is kind of an eye opener. So I might have to do a side hustle of this <laughs> if I get better. And the campus wants more minority students behind the controls. So to Today we wanted to encourage our female esports student athletes to come out and play to help encourage other girls on campus to come out and play as well just because it will help break them out their shell. It's fun and, and interacting. Dr. Afua Ampadumas is the director of the esports program at TSU. Really in gaming is so new in comparison to regular sports that you can really create the future. Whether it's coding, design, or sound, these students are learning their love for games can be a big win. People younger, especially black females, it's really scarce that we're in this uh, game industry. So it shows them when they look up and like they join TSU, they have a role here, they can play it. Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5.